I'm going to sum up this French film. How to make base moire. Well, for a start, get yourself a film camera. Don't be bothered about lighting. And try and get a couple of ugly ex-porn stars to agree to be in a film about two nasty, ruthless, stupid women who enjoy random violence, sex with strangers and murdering men and women. And you need to throw in a violent rape scene. And you want the sex to be real hardcore. You see, you need your audience to witness everything. And that's how you make base moi. Base Moi is about horrible characters that you couldn't give a toss about doing horrible things to other weirdos that you couldn't give a toss about. I just couldn't get into such a depressing story. There's no lighting designer and this decision is to give a realistic feel to the film. Whatever. The director seems to have zero creative judgement whatsoever. The story is unbelievable and the direction is so bad, I couldn't care less who died or survived. I had no empathy for anyone on screen. This film didn't engage me on any level. And I'm a big supporter of controversial films, especially stories that make an effort to break down boundaries. But filmmakers need to make their work intelligent, interesting, or at least engaging. Watching people having sex in a film isn't controversial anymore and it's rather unpleasant if the people doing it on screen aren't aesthetically pleasing to the eye. I was bored with this film. Base Moi must be just a bad student film that's been directed by an unsuccessful porn director. However, there's just two moments I actually liked. The first one is a moment where the two main characters are walking down a street at night when a stranger shouts something rude to him from across the street and one of the girls pulls a gun out and shoots him dead. Brutal and amusing. The second moment I liked was when the film ended. I must warn you, the rape scene is absolutely vile. And it's made worse because it's hardcore assault porn. It's worrying that porn mixed with brutality used in a film with no creative merit can be so popular. Don't be fooled by the standout bright pink DVD cover and the warning labels referring to brutal content. Just think of the label on the DVD as a warning not to watch this film because it's shit. It's 